Hey, it's Matt from UFP Rentals. Today I'm going to do a walkthrough of our new three-ton grip truck. So the first thing you'll notice here is we've got our crew cab. So it holds five. Lots of room in here to throw your crew. Traveling around set, around town. Up front here you've got lift gate controls and the uh, box dome lights. You got two 50 gallon tanks of diesel, so you've got a lot of range for traveling. The box is 18 feet long, 8 feet tall, and 8 feet wide, and it's got a 32 inch attic, so you've got enough space there, length, to be able to put 20 foot hardware, 20 foot pipe, so it even includes, this package includes a 20 by frame with hardware. The nice thing about it being a little bit shorter is that it's easy to take around town, easy to find parking, uh, you're not super long. And also, this does not require a CDL in order to drive this truck. In the bottom, you'll see there's four jockey boxes. We've got two short ones in the back and two large ones towards the front. So you've got a lot of space here for any kind of sandbags, cabling, whatever other additional equipment you need. Coming around towards the back on the doors, we've got all the brooms and axes and shovels, those kind of tools hanging from the doors. Lift gate, the large six foot lift gate. So you got a lot of space there for putting your carts, you're not worried about them falling off. A lot of space to work with. Take a look inside the box. All that height, you've got a lot of ladders up there, full complement of ladders. You've got a lot of spots to put overhead frames and pipe. Working our way around the side. Here's your lift gate controls standard controls up and down tilt and up and down lift and then you've got a switch here for rear lights up there for when you're working at night you can light up the area uh, lift gate remote controls are in here so if you want to be able to operate while you're going up and down there's your remote the truck also includes a plug-in to charge your battery and to help run the lift gate so that control is right there. Uh, there's your other uh, jockey box here. This one's full of uh, 35 pound sandbags. And these are reinforced, so you can put a lot of weight in there and not have to worry about overloading the jockey boxes. If we come over here, we're we'll getting inside. This is our side door. The side door is really convenient. You've got stairs up. But there's a door here, so if you don't want to, if you need more space inside, you can load carts onto here, you can load a fisher dolly on here. You're not wasting any space inside of the box. So we'll just flip that up, step inside here. So starting with the carts, we've got a 4x4 cart. You've got a large complement of 4x4s, a lot of floppies, a lot of diffusion frames. You've got two shiny boards show card and then you've got a full set of nd uh, cto ctb plus and minus green diffusion uh, you've even got tracing paper and a set of dots and fingers around the back here we've got a bunch of fernie pads and then all of your rags up here nicely organized into the totes on the left side here you've got all of your tools so we've got everything from wrenches to hole saws to drills and uh, power tools. You've got uh, electrical tools, uh, everything you might need for doing any sort of repairs while you're on set um, is all right there and ready to go. Uh, you've got pre-cuts plus uh, diffusion and CTB CTO. You've got a roll of duvetine if you need to make any, any cuts there. And then you've got a full set of expendables here so whether you need batteries or tape or light bulbs uh, rope all those things are available screws and nails is all ready to go right here uh, you've got a nice uh, big life cart for all your stands and light heads a taco cart four sets of apple boxes duvetine pre-cuts couple milk crates full of hardware uh, you've got a lot of expendables that are already included that you don't need to purchase. So if you need C47s and Pledge, Dulling Spray, uh, all kinds of stuff is available in there. And then you've even got 
a bunch of tennis balls if you're at a nice house and you need to protect your stand. Uh, up front, flags, two by threes, 18 by 24s, and some cutters. And then around the back side of the taco cart is uh, some mini mambos. On the right side, we've got a sandbag cart. And then this cart is our roller and mambo stand cart, custom made by Studio Carts. They did an awesome job. So you've actually got two mambo stands on here and four roller stands. And then you've got milk crates for hardware and tie downs and rope and everything else that you need for that. So really happy and pleased with that cart. And then an additional C-stand cart for all the rest of your C-stands. So that's the truck. Obviously a lot of space in the middle here for a Fisher dolly, dolly truck, whatever other equipment you might need. Um, check it out on our website for a full list of the contents, ufprentals.com.